This past weekend was a lot of fun because I got to spend it with old friends to celebrate my best friend's bachelor party. We went to a lot of cool places, specifically the collector's marketplace in Phoenix, and I got to pick up a lot of cool stuff. I picked up Jed McKay's Moon Knight number one, and even though I've never read a Moon Knight comic before, Alessandro Capuccio's vivid art is illuminating, and so I think this will be a good entry point. I picked up an X of Swords Destruction variant with my girl Ileana, and then I've got Morrison's new X-Men 2001 annual, because I love this era of X-Men and it showcases three of my favorite mutants. I found the Dakin vs X-23 collision paperback, which is awesome, I got it for about like 5 bucks, so of course I had to pick it up. And then I was super excited for the Reign of X trade paperback volume 1. Ever since Ten of Swords, I'm really excited for where the story continues to go. I love this era of X-Men. And then, talking about X-Men again, right? I got The End, which is Chris Claremont's final venture into the X-Men, so I'm gonna read through this. When it comes to toys, I finally found the second two packs of the Winter Gremlins from the original Christmas Caroling scene. One of my favorite pieces, and now that I have both sets of Gremlins, well, I can remake that as my personal Christmas nativity scene. When it comes to singles, I did also pick up a pretty cool Kamala Khan Miss Marvel toy. I don't think this is a Marvel legend, but she looks really good. But by far, my favorite pickup has to be the Tokusatsu legend himself, 1971's Takeshi Hongo as Kamen Rider. This is such an awesome pickup, and because its packaging was damaged pretty badly, I managed to get him for super cheap. And that works out great for me, because I don't keep them in the package. This common Rider is ready to bring the thunder. 